Looks like I can solo commenting. I'm gonna get it. Let's see what we can do with this. Let me uh, change these names real quick. Ref, what's your guys' team name? What? Team Penguin? Why? We're gonna see uh, Twisty K Wills on again for like the third time in a row. And uh, is that one here? Huh? Thank you. We'll come to you. Sure, you can go down your shit. That was winner's finals. This is winner's finals already? Wow. Double's winner's finals. It's gonna be tight between two good teams. Team Penguin, which is uh, Freeze and Bills. Uh, Bills, a. What? I'm commentating. Winners finals. Fuck, you know what? Whatever. Uh, shit. Uh, Atlas! Are you gonna be playing singles? Are you about to play your singles match? Can you commentate things so I can go play mine? I guess I'm hopping off. Atlas is gonna commentate with uh, Victor here. Get out. Shut the fuck up, Victor. Just kidding. Oh, I'll be hacking. Yeah, alright. See you later, skater. Alright. Hey, Atlas. Come on. Right now we got Team Penguin against Team Wells right now. No, I haven't seen him play, so, but, can you give me, uh, how do I get it? Alright, so, uh, all of these players are all members of the same group, so they should know each other pretty well. Um, these are not the typical teams they do, so I'm wondering if they've been practicing this, or if they just kind of, uh, felt like it today, or I what? think you're just swinging it. Yeah. Um, personally, I think... Wario Luigi have the advantage character-wise. Uh, Luigi's ridiculous ground mobility uh, lets him be anywhere he needs to be, and he's a good stock tank because he'll always make it back to the stage, and he's hard to combo. Yeah. It's just like, Luigi makes a great devil's character. Um, however, he is the first one to go on blue team, so I don't know. No, I've never seen a Wario and Luigi team up before. I, I think it'd make a good combo. Because it's from the same universe? <laughs> uh, no, that wasn't what I was thinking. Oh, okay. But, um, uh, Wario has very good air mobility, and Luigi has excellent ground mobility. Together, they can cover any option, and they don't interfere with each other, is the most important thing. Oh, yeah. Because uh, Wario constantly wants to be in the air, and Luigi always wants to be near the ground. Yeah, the way Dash has a lot of coverage. Yeah. Whereas, for example, uh, Ganondorf might accidentally smack Game & Watch. Or Game oh, like, oh! Wow, he almost stopped his partner there. Yeah. Ooh, good use of the fart by Twisty. Just barely made it back oh. and somehow killed Ganondorf. <laughs> wow, poor Bills. Oh, well. Who's still using Kibo. Uh, I'm not sure what's up with that. Maybe it's from setting. Alright, uh, Twisty gets a nice edge guard in the back here on the left side of the stage. Uh, right now, Team Twill, Twil Twillis, Twillis is up six socks to two. And whoa! Alright, uh, so that's what I'm talking about, about uh, Game & Watch and Gandorf have both have huge hitboxes. Mm -hmm. So Gandorf just got killed by uh, a parachute. Woo! Oh, wow, I did not see a parachute coming. Yeah, neither did I. Good play by Freeze. He's doing well in the 2v1 so That's far. That's really doing good. Uh, he's staying mobile. He's throwing out quick attacks only. Nothing with long end lag. Uh, except that grab. Grab has long end lag on Game Watch. Because he has no quick throws. Uh, so that way he can constantly smack one person away and then fight the other one. Smack the other person away, fight the other one. Yeah, right now he's in the hit and run strategy at the moment. Right. And that's why really he's getting hit. Uh, Game Watch is not going to make it back. Mm. Oh. 
All right. T Team Twillis takes game one right there. T Willis? Yeah, I guess it is T Willis. Because Swisty and K Willis. That's, that's pretty cool, bro. T Willis. So I think with Team Willis will pick for a map advantage. Uh, T Willis is banning right now. Oh, my They get bad. three bans. Uh, I mean, Team Penguin. Team Penguin. I don't I'd say a shorter map. I think they're going to stay the same characters. I think the smaller the map, the less their opponent's mobility helps. Yeah, but then Ganon might hit his partner. Yeah, but it also means he has two opponents to accidentally hit. Oh, that's true. You know? Well, this map's like a little smaller. Alright, well, uh, Freeze switched from Game & Watch to Mario. <laughs> um, I don't know how I feel about that. I I think Immortal to have better edge guarding. I think. Because I did some edge guarding on Fox, just with bears. Without a match. Game & Watch could do the same thing. Ooh, good up air from uh, Bills there. Wow, alright, Ganjos just got two kills. Good play by Bills. I think this map's in their favor now. Well, I like the double stop right there. Alright, Twisty choosing the back throw Bills toward the edge so he can get an easy edge guard. Oh my goodness! Uh, I was hoping for a Ganon friendly fire, but not for the Mario. So, Freeze, the Mario player, was trying to force um, the blue team away from the ledge so that Bills could make it back, but instead Bills recovered to that location. Yeah, it kind of backfired. Yeah. It was just uh, poorly timed, really. Oh, I don't know if it could have been better time either. So. Well, it's doubles. Like, anything could happen. Cool. Uh, I like that expect up bears. But I got it. Alright, Gan's not going to make it back unless he gets someone to recover off of. And now Mario might not make it back. The platform's there, and uh, Bills with oh no, okay. Bills did a very good job of jumping in his Ganondorf and forcing pressure upon the opponents. So you saw Twisty, the warrior player, grabbed Bills uh, instead of edge guarding uh, Freeze, the Mario player. Mm -hmm. And then they got a kill off of that. So jumping in to help your teammate is very important. At least threaten to help. Uh, actually throwing out attack is not always the best move, and if you do throw out attack, you want to throw out one that uh, doesn't hit your teammate, which means you have to be careful with the spacing. Uh, a lot of players aren't used to perfectly hitting with the tip of their moves, uh, especially faster characters like to hit with the solid part of their move on their way through, so they cross up shields, and that's just safe shield pressure, uh, so they end up on top of opponents for quicker moves that uh, are short range. Yeah, I feel the same. It's something like throwing out moves can also imitate your opponents. Like charging the side smash, they'll panic. They might like SD, you know, on like an edge. Sure. But my point is more that uh, players that are used to trying to uh, pass through their opponents instead of perfect space for moves uh, do worse in doubles in general just because uh, they hit their opponents, they hit their teammates too. Just like that. Uh, yeah, or they um, they always get into the fray, and they'll accidentally get hit by something. Whereas character players that are more you, wow, you just flying on that shield. Um, whereas players that are more used to trying to perfectly space something will hover around the outside of a fight and not get destroyed by two players. Also, uh, players that are used to combo-centric characters typically do worse as well because they still try to perform their combos and those combos get interrupted. By the teammates. Yes. Or they perform uh, the long lag moves that would start those combos. And if it, even if it starts a combo, they don't actually get a full combo out of it because it gets intercepted. Yeah. Like right there, uh, he went for the best possible follow-up for that combo which was, um, didn't, didn't you guys, are, uh, this is winner's finals? Oh, yeah, it's one. Yeah, it's That was fast. Okay.
All right, well, uh, pardon me. That was really fast. <laughs> why is everyone watching over here? Why, why don't you guys all go over there? Watch from, watch from that side. I am relaxed, thanks. Was someone said that? Huh? Someone said you're relaxed? Yeah, someone told me to relax. Oh. Wow. I am relaxed? You'll know when I'm pissed off. I, I never seen an it. angry atlas in my life. I've seen a singing atlas before. I've gotten an angry here before. Oh, but I this map's in favor of um, T. Wills. Well, because of Luigi. I agree. Which is odd. Um, I don't know what happened to her before. I think oh, that, wow. Oh, well, I was already in three stocks each on green team. Oh! Well, I like that conversion right there. Alright. Well, maybe they did practice together. Ooh! Oh. Wow, what are all these reverse hitboxes? I have no idea. But that. Ooh. Oh! Good awareness from Bills. He came all the way from center stage to cover the high part of the edge guard, while Freeze stood near the ledge and covered the low part. Oh. oh, I thought he was going to hit his opponent right I mean, his teammate right there. I like what you're doing right now. They're separating their opponents from each other, so that way... Oh! 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 Wow! I couldn't tell that was a misfire! I, I think... Was it? I, I think it was. it was a misfire. It was flashing green. <laughs> Yeah, I just couldn't tell. Wow. Alright, sorry, what were you saying? Who's doing a good job of separating their opponents? Uh, I think Green Team is doing a good job of separating their opponents so I can focus on their opponent and not hit each other. Unlike in, like in Smashville, mm. I know it's like Ganon like, hit Mario a lot in that map. So the thing is, Luigi is so fast compared to these other characters that Luigi should be able to turn any of those 1v1s into a 2v1 oh, immediately. Yeah. So I would think Green Team wouldn't want to separate their opponents, um, but it does seem to be doing well for them. So it's working out. Also, perhaps they're both better at one v oneing their opponents. I mean, sometimes I jump in for a two v one, just like with that Ganon slam. Remember, also like all of these players know each other. Like they're all just part of the same crew. They know each other really well. Oh yeah. So it's possible that they. They feel more confident in those 1v1s because they're used to playing each other. Wow. Alright. Well. Whoa! That was bizarre. <laughs> I. What just happened? I don't know. I think I only seen the, the Ganon Bear on the world. Oh! oh the second green missile on Ganon. Oh. Alright, he didn't get off the legend that. Oh, it makes it back. Alright, blue team still has four stocks to two. Um, so I think blue team can do this. Especially because this should make that Ganon door. Yeah. And guess. this should also be a dead yeah, Mario. Oh, oh yeah. Alright. That was good coverage right there. Great play from Team T. Willis. Takes out Team Penguin, knocks him into losers. 3-0. Um, can we get something on stream? Uh, I don't think the loser bracket has gone that far. I didn't know how to actions in the track at the moment. How? I, my team hasn't been eliminated yet. Lose, losers hasn't gone that far yet. <laughs> like it just, it just hasn't gone that far. I, I don't know what to tell you, unless I just got eliminated randomly. Surprise, DQ'd. All right, wisdom sitting down here at the stream setup, you still in giving wisdom? me the. Stare of death. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to stop off. Why? Because he's my singles. Oh, our singles started already? Yeah. Yeah, singles started. Aww. Did you not sign up? 
No, I did. I did. I, I was. I was eating pizza. 